Speaking to NBC News ahead of the 2021 academic year, Moyo noted that many students who signed loan agreements with the fund, some dating back to 2018, have not been honored yet. Of us traveling 700 kilometers from Rundu or 1,000 kilometers from Katima Mlilo to Winduk in order for us to be assisted. Why should we have one office in one country? This a, 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 a big nation. It consists of 14 regions. Therefore, we should have offices in all the regions so that the services and the finances are shared inclusive. The fund has a student services portal where students may log in their queries, but Moyo claims this has been ineffective. The biggest challenge is when I'm not logging on my NSF uh, portal, it becomes a challenge because I would have to send an email to them and wait for the response. And that response might take a month or might be, I might be responded if I'm lucky or if the student is lucky at that point of time. So not everyone is attended to. NASFAF Acting Chief Executive Officer Kennedy Kandume says the fund streamlined its services to online and remains adamant the process has been a success so far. Kandume notes that NASFAF services are mostly seasonal, thus officials deployed at regional offices would soon become underutilized. He says where the need arises, the fund usually dispatches a team to a specific region to attend to critical student queries.